everyone just a short introduction to this vlog um yeah it's just a, a random old day um yeah you can uh, find out uh, how we both got our own little surprises today dave finally got to ride that mower but like uh -huh. <laughs> yeah dave's a cameraman he's still here mm. i haven't uh, buried him under a patio or anything like that not yet <laughs> still early um yeah what well, gonna be a short intro shut up dave um yeah so what's out dave, dave might get to ride a mower and then uh, a little package arrives with my name on it so enjoy guys well, see you on the on it. It had my name on it we'll see you on the other end guys bye bye Well, I'm off out, do a bit of some bats, leave dogs alone for a bit with missus. As you do. Oh, look at that look. You don't need to have a shower, just let dogs have a lick of you. And Grumpy's over there. You know how she's up here, not oh, life's up here, look. What are we doing up there, love? Um, I'm just doing a bit of pre-site work for the where we're going next. Oh, I thought we were back travelling. When we're back travelling? No, we're back travelling for the first. Yeah, yeah, we get to, we get a month off after we leave here before we go to our next site. Yes, we've decided that we're going to do some more work at uh, some campsites. A bit more, uh, as you do, volunteering here, there and everywhere. Gets us round, don't it? Gets us round the country. Totally different part of the country, can't wait. Yeah. So you're all set up up there then? Yeah, you've heard of standing offices. Well, this is a, a bed office, bed a laying office. office. Mm -hmm. I've got all my little uh, administrators mm -hmm. all here. You forgot little miss. Ah, oh, yes, the cats are there, look. Yes, we're all here, ready to work. Yes. So, uh, yeah, you go do sight things, darling, and uh, well, we'll just stay here, won't we, guys? As you do. As you do. Hey, up, campers. Another welly day. All days are welly days. Well, hopefully, something special is going to happen today. Let's get these on. Lower shed, and hopefully it's going to work. I've had Paul in, his paws had a go at it, and hopefully now the thing will work. So we've got to get up there then, eh? A little bit to cut in. Well, if it don't go today, I'm going to take it around back, I'm going to chop it in little pieces and bury it. How's about that? But no end of trouble as this thing costs. So let's get it out of here and uh, start it up and get it on to uh, grass. That's what it's getting paid for. Yeah. It's getting paid to cut grass. Not sitting here looking pretty. Yeah. Well, Bobby, what's happening out there, lad? Can you see what I can see? <gasps> Is that your papa? Looks like I might be getting a bit dizzy out there. But yeah, it's been dry for a few days, so uh, he's uh, finally getting round to cutting that grass. <laughs> oh my god, his concentric circles are getting smaller and smaller. There we go, we're going for that middle bit. What do you think, Bob? Does he get the job? How funny. Let me get that last bit. Come on, Dave, get that last bit. Tell him, tell him Bob, tell him, Bobby. Excuse our filthy windows. That's, uh, 
I always have a little sign on my windows that says they're not dirty it's our dog's nose art so yeah, yeah just making sure right then oh you're doing a cracking job there lad what do you think yeah all right it's like watching tennis isn't it bob yeah Don't look like he's going anywhere else. He's just going to ride around on that bit all day, isn't he? Oh dear. Do we think we've got it now? Do we? That's it. Oh, he's got that last bit down middle. And is that it? Are we going? Are we going? No. Oh, oh such a perfectionist. Such a perfectionist. Right into them edges. That's it. That's got to be it now. And it. Come on, Bob. Even you've got to agree that has got to be it. No. Oh. <laughs> right. Leave us a comment below um, on uh, how we think this is going, folks, because. Uh, that one piece of grass is getting it. I don't know what it's done to him, but uh, yeah, he's uh, certainly uh, massacring it. Yeah, me and Bob agree. What in heaven's name? Oh, I think we're thinking about taking the blades up. Look at that beard. I were born for it, weren't we, guys? Born for it. Right then. He's sending me dizzy, I can't watch it anymore. What about you, Bob? Shall we uh, we finish that there? Bobby? Bob? Bob? Oh, you do know your name. He love. Right then, we'll say goodbye to your dad. Hey! And he's off, he's going somewhere else. Brilliant. Right then, are you going to say bye to your viewers, Bob? Bob? Bobby? Are you going to say bye to everybody? Bye bye! There we go, bit of cutting grass. What can I say? Paul's worked his magic. He's a good lad, isn't he? Right, I'll leave you there. We'll get on with this. Going around in circles. As you do. Know. Okie dokie, catch you in a bit. So oh, there you go. It's a funny old job, but uh, I've got all the grass cut. Not the prettiest ever, but it's cut. And the uh, last bit, rover in the corner over there. We noticed tyre were going flat and uh, that'll stop working again it's uh, we're not problem now it's one of the front pulleys but uh, how weird is that you get you know what I mean you get it all done so the, the it's lasted out as a as a machine and then uh, conked out it last bit so anyway this side's done touring bit's done the, uh, the uh, season on the other side haven't been done. Look at that. Look at that. See a wheel. You know what I mean? Look at that. 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 Look I'm going to go back in Martha now and have a nice hot chocolate or something like that. What do you think? Might have an old biscuit. Now then, box come for us today. Oh, it's the first um, one we received for uh, Arthur the Van Duel. What it is? It says fragile. It's fragile. It might say Martha and the Van Dwellers, but it says jet. Oh, it says jet, so yeah, it's not for me. Then. Okay. It's not for you.
Half of a band of us. Yeah, it's the first one I had here for to uh, oh, no, 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 we did. We got one. We got a sticker the other day. It was post. Oh, we got a sticker. Yeah, okay. we got a sticker. We, got a sticker. For... we never mentioned that one, do we? No, no, we will do. Anyway, here we are. Oh, I'm going to up and have a look. Oh, a little something for wow. you. Oh, something for you. To Jack, lots of love, Julie and Craig. <laughs> Julie and Craig. Oh, hey, hey! Are you ready? Oh, nice. uh, well, oh. what can I say? That fits Absol straight in, doesn't it? I can't understand why they bought that. Oh, I don't know. No, I can't understand why they bought that. Oh, oh, thank you very much. Well, thank you, guys. So, what's the curry, my love? Well, Craig and Julie have bought me this rather magnificent mug. This is a very magnificent mug. It, it is, fits yes. right into the Van Dweller house. So, Craig Cover. and Julie, we absolutely love it. So, thank you very much. It does fit really well into the So, sometime later, motor home. And you didn't even mention that it came from Max either. Max, their lovely spring the spaniel. Right. So, yeah, sometime later, motor home. I'm going to do it justice. And uh, it's getting a real hot chocolate with Belgian chocolate. So, yeah, and, uh, I might just be making Dave one in another zebra mug. But, That'd be nice. Uh, how fantastic's that? Mm. Looking forward to that, guys. Much appreciated. Mm. Oh, we're still on? Oh, oh dear. Still on. Right, so, yeah, you put your chocolate in there. You warm your milk up, you don't let your milk boil, by the way. Alright. And uh, the top tip is to put a bit of water onto your real chocolate, hot water, just to melt it a bit, stops it splitting. I got that from a real chocolate shop. And uh, then you pour your not so boiling milk on top, give it a stir, um, a few marshmallows, mm. and uh, a good old squirt of cream. A little sprinkle and you're good to go. So it's it's good for any diet really. Yeah, it's probably about 450 calories in a mug. But they say that uh, you have been riding that mower today, so good for you. I think you sort mm. of deserve it. And Lent is coming up. Oh, Lent's You'll coming. all get to understand Dave and Lent very shortly. But mm. uh, for now, we've got to be celebrating all things chocolate and all things dairy because uh, they're not going to be around for 44 days once Lent starts. So 44? Yeah, 44 this year, love ya. 44. I think it's more than that, isn't it? So it's 44 days this year. Are you sure I looked at the calendar? Oh, good calendar. 44 days. 44 days, well I do done, yeah. Hey, wife's always right. Yeah, but it's more than 44, you know. Well, you've written 44. I know. I've wrote 44. Be worth it. But it's not that way Sunday, like you say. Isn't it? Oh, okay. Well, we don't know about that, love. We'll see anyway. We will. That's in the, that's in the future. Yeah. So, I've told you how to make cho hot chocolate. Why don't you come back later and I'll show you how to make hot chocolate. So we're back. Right, so From I told you. From our space. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, so I told you, so let's show you. So what we have here is... Mm -hmm. Eight chunks of chocolate. We've worked out over the years that eight chunks of chocolate is the perfect amount of chocolate. Um, this is what I do because we don't have a milk pan. Just do it. All pans have got to be multifunctional and sometimes, you know, it spills. So that's me. All bases covered. Can't believe I'm doing such a good job at pouring this milk out mm, here. It's pretty good, is that? So, yeah, some nice add milk on top of some yummy delicious chocolate we can pop that away don't look in my unruly cupboards what's that right Dave likes a few marshmallows I like them in there get them a bit melty melty I can't believe somebody's watching me make hot chocolate but I couldn't tell you how to make hot chocolate yeah we uh, flies already what's that about one of our favourite things when we lived in Bricks and Mortar, we lived for holidays and uh, we used to break up our big holidays with mini cruises 
and I buy a mini cruise it's a it's a nighttime boat crossing usually so somewhere like Amsterdam or Bruges and we discovered Bruges and hot chocolate um, and you can't go back once you've had hot chocolate made with real Belgian chocolate there's just no going back mm. so that's all nicely dissolved in there now and the cameraman's not even bothering to look I can't tip it up because it'll go all over the floor so yeah so that's there I'll give Dave's a little stir he likes his marshmallows a little bit melty and then we uh, top it off with a good dollop of whipped cream and a little sprinkle. Dave's goes a bit different because not only does he get marshmallows under his cream, he gets a little few on top of his cream, worth not want that, and he gets a little sprinkle. And Dave's comes with a spoon, so cheers. cheers. Really grateful. Thank you. Had to be done. Oh yeah. Okay. Giving it the true send off or the true start in life in Van in Martha. What am I saying? Yes, it's getting a proper start in Martha. Thank you. Love you. <laughs> Right, so we're, uh, Dave's already showed you his fancy mowing, hasn't he? So uh, no need to do that. But yeah, I've got to go up to office because we've uh, got an arrival coming. So uh, yeah, I'll have a little trot up there. Might show you what's been going on round there. So uh, we'll uh, just follow me. He hadn't uh, closed that mower shed, so uh, I will do that for him before we go into the office. So uh, normally this is how Neil starts and ends his day at our summer ward, isn't he? Yeah? Um, so yeah, Dave's been out and about today as you've seen on the mower. Oh, but yeah, let me show you what's occurred. Um, Right, you're ready for this, guys. Hmm. We've got a little bit of a tyre problem. <coughs> so, yeah, it's in retirement again. So, yeah, here we go. Shut it down. Oh, nearly blew me over, did that wind? Oh. Give a man a job and he does half a job, doesn't he? So, puts his mower away, don't close his shed. Man cave indeed. Right, so, that's that. Oh, uh, bum 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 bum, here we go again. Right, so oh. ah, my wish I'd done. Yes, sir. I'll just start to uh, get ready for uh, one more arrival today, and uh, then we're done. So, uh, a few parcels. Ha! Ah, saw my name there. So we like that, don't we? Right. Oh yes, one last seasonal pitch left here for the summer, if you're interested. Okay, so into the office and uh, yeah, I'll just get their key ready and then we're good to go. So another little update on uh, what's been occurring. So yeah, we've obviously still got the uh, ground men in. Still doing a bit of work. That's where our old double garage was. But yeah, check this out. I have to say, I've been super hard at it. And uh, yeah, lovely new fence. But, pierce de resistance. 
this little bad boy. Oh gorgeous, is that gonna look? And that's all lit up at night as you drive down the road and approach. Big sign on the wall. Welcome to the nurseries. In here come. Yeah. Things are changing. It's looking great. Well, we think so, but then we're biased. Hey up. You alright after that? You're quite good that one, eh? Yeah. Do you like it, missus? What's that you got there then? This is my new friend. Where have you got that from? Well, a friend commissioned it from a lovely local called K. Mm. So I just want to say thank you to OK Crochet for our beautiful new van dweller. Mm. Yay! Can we fit it in? Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure he's so tiny. He'll, he'll squeeze in. He'll squeeze in. Eat a lot. So, yeah. So, thank you. Another mouth to feed. <clears throat> Another. Well, we have had a few mouths to feed today, haven't we? Mm. So, yeah. Thanks to Anne and Kay for our beautiful new van dweller. Mm. And, uh, obviously, Julian Craig mm, yes. from Sometime Later Motorhome. We really enjoyed our hot chocolates this afternoon. And that cup has truly been christened. Yes, very thoughtful. Thank you. And we did mention that we'd got a sticker through the post this week. So I want to say thank you to, oh, I don't know whether you can see that, Dog in the Motorhome. Thank you very much for your sticker. We also passed those on to uh, the uh, other parties that you posted them out to. So, yes, thank you very much. Thank you. And we want to give a cheeky shout out to Martin Burgess. Okay, this is for Martin, Tracy, Jack and Monte. From all of us fan dwellers. Yes. Thank so you. I think that's pretty much covered everybody. Yeah. Isn't it? What, what, what the name of that um that sticker? Dog in the motorhome. Alright. Yeah. Dog in the motorhome. Even though he's got dogs, two dogs. So thank you to the two humans and the two dogs that sent us Dog in the Motorhome sticker. He has a YouTube channel. I will try and put them all down in the details below. Yes. Okay. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm. So can we just say uh, a big thank you for your uh, watching? Yeah. Thank you for your subscribing. Thanks to all the new subscribers. Thanks to all the old subscribers. The people that are still sticking with us. Yeah. Don't forget we love a thumbs up. I think, uh, I don't know. Maybe getting better. I don't know what you think. Maybe we're getting worse. I don't know. Don't open that can of worms. The, um, are these, um, uh, uh, some of you have noticed the, the crystals behind us. Um, oh, yeah. It's a big passion of mine, and we'll go into that in a bit. So that'd be good boy, to have a talk about them. Yeah. Now then, so I'll like say a big thank you to everybody. Um, okay. So once again, like the thumbs up thumbs we up. love to read your comments yes. and uh what do we do dave ring my bell yeah ring so where's the bell, bell dave i think it's down there is okay it? i think <laughs> yeah. I don't know. all right then so if you want an upload um hmm. notification well yeah. if you want a notification of when we next upload then uh, hit that bell and please press subscribe Plus. Yeah, please press, yeah, subscribe. Please press. We, both of us needed to put us teeth in today, yes, didn't we? Sure, yes. Right, okay then, guys. All right. And, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see you in a couple of days. Catch you on the next one. Bye. Bye.